Well, Ariel, Steve, we were at the scene on 93 just a few hours ago alongside state police and several fire and police crews. At this point in the night, we are waiting for a official press release from state police. But here's what we know so far. The New Hampton Fire Chief and State Police tell me crews got the call and responded to the crash around 452 this afternoon. EMS and fire officials from Meredith, Ashland, Sanberton, all assisting on scene. Now this crash happened in an area right between Meredith and New Hampton. All lanes on the southbound side of the highway near exit 23 were shut down for almost two hours, according to State Police. But they've all been since reopened and from what we saw, traffic was flowing pretty normally. We did see one car that did have heavy damage to it. And we also saw a helicopter on scene. The New Hampton Fire Chief did also tell me the five people who were injured from this crash were all taken to hospitals. One woman who was stuck in traffic during all of this describes what she saw. We were there for over an hour, stopped on the highway, and, um, you know, traffic not moving at all. And then we finally saw the DART helicopter take off. And about 15 minutes later, traffic started to move. And again, we are still waiting to hear from state police on how those five injured people are doing tonight. We will, of course, be following up with them throughout the night tonight and bring you more information as soon as it's available to us. For now, we're live in New Hampton. Imani Fleming, WMUR News 9.